it's a really important day for ABC News. This is a real symbol of how important news is as part of the service that we deliver to, to Australian audiences. And today it's an opportunity for people to really tap into the breadth and depth of ABC News television reporting when they wanted to, to watch our content. Um, so the channel is a mixture of uh, existing programming, so our flagship fantastic programs like 7.30 Report, Insiders, Australian Story and Four Corners, and new programming strands as well. And of course this channel is all about rolling news, so when news breaks we will be broadcasting it. The audience's needs have changed. Uh, we used to deliver uh, news to television audiences at midday and 7pm alone. Uh, we now feel that it's really important to not only continue to cater to those important audiences but also offer people a chance to see news as it happens. There's always a focus on cost when it comes to the ABC. How much is this project costing and where is the money coming from? Well, the money has, um, is coming from savings that the corporation has been able to achieve, which has been fantastic. It, it's meant that we've been able to deliver new services to audiences. We're not talking about the cost of the channel, but it's been a really important investment for the ABC to deliver new services to audiences. The savings have been made through uh, the production review, which has seen a change in the way we operate through automated studios, through desktop editing. So, so cuts haven't been made to programs. The programs will be part of the service that we deliver to, to audiences. So the existing programs, the valuable programs like the 7.30 Report and Late Line and Insiders and Australian Story are very much part of this channel. We don't want to do anything to ever undermine the, valuable, uh, the value that those, those programs provide to audiences and to ABC News. What have viewers said to you? Have viewers asked for this service? Do they expect it in this digital age of multi-channels? Well, we've seen through our online um, provision that, that uh, audiences now expect to see news when it happens and they also expect to be able to tap into news when it suits them. Um, so as I say, that it's really important to deliver um, scheduled news to, to audiences on ABC One through the Midday Report and through 7pm bulletins. Those bulletins remain our flagship bulletins, but it's also important to be able to deliver the breadth of news that we collect on a day-to-day -day basis to audiences at other times of the day. There have been some loud critics, uh, in particular Sky, which I'm assuming you see as the main competitor to this service. Sky says that, that this violates the ABC's charter, that it's a duplication of services that already exist, a waste of taxpayers' money. What do you say to some of those criticisms? Look, we're very much focused on, on what we do, and I think that this service is, is designed to ensure that we are remaining relevant to modern audiences and that we're giving audiences the services that they expect at this time. So that our motivation has absolutely been to deliver what audiences need and want from the ABC and to deliver value for money to, to Australians. There have been some people upset that it's on the HD channel, they're losing ABC One on HD or they can't get HD at home. Will it stay on HD forever? Look, we, we will constantly be re reviewing uh, the delivery and this was the, the best option for us to be able to achieve a news channel at this time. So in 2013 we'll, we'll re review that. What will this mean for the future of the 7pm bulletins around the country? Will they actually skew to be more local because presumably it will run a national 7pm at the same time? The 7pm bulletins remain our flagship television news services and uh, we really believe that part of the value of this is allowing national audiences to see some of that brilliant content that's coming out of our state newsrooms but until now has really been restricted to state audiences. So the value I think for, for the broader audience is to be able to tap into some of those great state stories uh, via ABC News 24 but the 7pm state bulletins remain absolutely vital uh, to the service that we deliver.